Hello there, folks, and welcome back to XCOM Enemy Within. We have six turns to reach a truck on this dam that is about to break. So, um, yeah, let's get moving. I'm going to switch to a pistol. Not that it really matters. And we're going to book it like we've never booked it before. Because this is a pretty long dam, and we've only got six turns. The dam has already taken heavy damage, but it looks like we can delay the collapse if we open the bypass valves positioned along the way to the transport. Okay, so it looks like if we activate these little hatches here, we can delay the dam blowing up, which is exactly what we need to do, and we need to do it fast, because once we spot the enemies, it'll be much, much, much harder to do this, so... Let's get booking it. Yes, he has a grenade launcher on him now, which is cool. He only has a minigun, but... No, he's... Is he the one with the minigun? Yeah, he's the one with the minigun. But still, he's got a minigun. <laughs> and we have three mechs with us. We're going to want to get the tech so that we can get more than um, the Mark One mechs, which is what we have right now. But we'll get that as soon as we get our new fighter craft. And by doing this mission, we should get 100 bucks, so that should be nice. We'll be able to buy some new fighter craft with that, which is our main objective to... Hostile aircraft? Oh, crap. Oh, crap. <laughs> They're a mite bit close, I would say. Um, we are literally within spitting distance. And I forgot to change weapons, but he did three damage. <laughs> Oh, I'm an idiot. Um, you, with your kinetic strike, go here and hug him in the face with your kinetic... Oh, crap. Yep, we're doing damage. He's getting a lot of damage done to him. Forgot they were on Overwatch. But somebody had to trigger it. Getting in close. Boom. Holy balls. <laughs> All right, that worked quite well. Well, Kinetic Strike was already triggered, or uh, Overwatch was already triggered, so. Let's see what this minigun does. A lot. It does a lot. <laughs> and it seems as though it has better damage potential than... Not damage potential, but it has uh, better damage per magazine than uh, the railgun does. You know what? We're going to have you switch to your pistol. I know, I know. I, I shouldn't be doing this, but we need them on Overwatch because they're going to be dropping in more units imminently. Alright, you. Get up here. And turn that off. Next turn. You only have five turns before the dam collapses. Incoming? Okay, so they're not incoming. But you. I'm going to switch you back. Because I know I will forget to switch you back eventually. So you go over here. And... Can you turn it? Oh, don't say you have to be exactly right there. You do. That's lame. That valve is running wide open. We still need to secure the truck before it's too late. All right. So we're going to go here, and then we're going to go on Overwatch. We need at least some people on Overwatch when the enemies drop in, which they will be dropping in very shortly. And so there's one more valve up there, so that means we'll have a total of nine more turns. And we got Thin Men with big old plasma rifles. You can't see anything, so... Up you go. Actually, you know what? I thought the minigun had better uh, damage potential, but it really doesn't. Because it used half of its rounds just for that one shot. So we're definitely going to be eating more railguns in the future. Uh, you. Go over here. Well, you can actually fire at the enemy right now, or can you throw a grenade on them? That would be super cool. No. So what if we switch weapons? What's your chance that you can hit them? 55 and 55. 
Well, knowing how you did last time. Okay, one damage. Can't expect miracles every single turn. Okay, you don't have any damage done to you, so you can tank a little bit. All right, you can shoot one of them, two of them. What about flamethrower them? Just out of range, so we're gonna see if we can at least get rid of one. Nope. Looks like the aliens are sending in reinforcements, Commander. And we're gonna take some damage. Ooh, shooting at that guy. That's not a good thing. I thought they wouldn't be able to see him. Well, they're dead, so there's that. Okay, good thing they didn't shoot at him, because he is actually really close to dying. We're going to have to see if we can get some health incoming. Really? <laughs> well, looks like Overwatch paid off. Holy shit. <laughs> um, no. Remember, we need to operate this. Bypass valve. There we go. We got more turns. Let's uh, let's take care of the big guy first. You. Yes, you. Goodbye. Good solid shot to the face. No ammunition remaining. You. What about you? No, you. Yes, you. Hmm. We can launch grenades. Haven't done that yet. But do we have anybody that has a health pack? No. Okay, so that's an issue. 80% chance. Let's uh, see what you can do. There we go. Good solid six damage. We only need to do a little bit more to kill him. So we'll have you try to kill him. 92% chance. Hard to miss. And that's right. Well, you know what we're doing then. We're going to have to waste a big old round on him, but we can't have him survive. Okay, that was successful. And we have another shot, so we'll take out the other guy that's threatening us. And very, very, very good. You, only 60% chance, well, we can, we can solve that because flamethrower doesn't miss. And I think that's about it for doing damage. I don't think that he can shoot. Let's see. Still no spot on him, so we're going to have him hunkered down. Do we have anybody else that can fire? I think we used all of our turns, actually. We're taking a lot of damage. Unfortunately, we had to move up aggressively, otherwise um, bad things would have been happening. Well, they're, they are happening, but even worse things would be happening. Okay. Make with the flamethrower. Surprised that actually didn't reach him. Looks as though it did. No, we're going to have him uh, do this. Operate. So we have more turns now. And you can actually shoot him, so we're going to do that. Or not. Ooh, you don't have any any weapons whatsoever. I'm gonna have to have you reload, but first please, please kill him. There we go. Good, good job. Mr. Mueller, good. you have your laser rifle out, which is exactly what we need. However, you can't run through the flames right now, so... In Coffin, we're going to have to have you run up. And we're going to reload you. More hostiles inbound, unfortunately. 
and our mechs have taken severe damage. And we got big guys inbound too. <laughs> oh man. No, switch back to your rifle. Can't really see anyone, unfortunately. You can, but you can't shoot them, so reload your gun. Switch to your laser <laughs> rifle this time. And see if you can't hurt him a little bit. Oh, come on, you're fired. Unfortunately, everybody on our team has to reload. Um, which could be better. Looks like we're going to only get some damage in with a pistol this turn. Uh, hopefully you can kill him. We'll mitigate some of the damage. Yeah, there we go. Alright, you are in bad shape, so we're going to move you over here so you can get... Ooh, lightning reflexes. Good, good, good. That triggered the uh, mech to miss. Eighty percent chance. Don't miss this one. There we go. Did some damage. Not fantastic. You, you have ammo. In fact. Oh yes, yes. I don't know how much damage this does. Four damage to enemies. What about that? Seventy-eight percent chance. That's gonna do a lot more than four damage. So. Okay, six damage. Not a lot more, but it's more. And we have another shot. The potential to kill him. And fantastic it worked. Got him. So we just have this sectoid who's going to be scurrying around. Probably not too uh, happy with himself right now. Alright, we're going to have him switch weapons to his laser sniper. And because he shot at him, he gets to kill him. All right, now we really need to start moving up, so I'm going to have him run towards that uh, release valve. We only have six turns, so we really need to move. Really, really need to move. Luckily, all our guys are reloaded now, so that's nice. You have full health, so you get to be the tip of our spear. And Johnson, you have your sniper out, as you should. And we're going to move up as fast as possible. Here they come. And we got Thin Man inbound. Cover my flank. So we're going to see if we can't get some uh, spots on them. So what are they going to be doing? Probably shooting at our guys would be what they're doing. No, leave my guy alone. If you kill him, I'll be very sad. And I think he is actually probably going to explode this turn. <laughs> we just upgraded him with a grenade launcher too. Oh, thank the lord. He shot at someone else. <laughs> okay. Mueller, you're lagging behind. All right, we'll get you going up here then. Understood. Moving out. Next turn, we'll turn that, and hopefully we'll be mostly across this dam. Okay, so we're not even close to mostly across this dam yet. It's way the heck over there. And there's another release valve over there. We'll see if our sniper can't turn him off. And we need you to reload, so do that. That's affirmative. Looks as though he can't see them, so... 
Overwatch, you. Only a 35% chance. That's pretty bad, actually. What about a grenade? No. Well, in fact, we're gonna wait, see if somebody else can't get a better shot. Thirty. Hmm. We'll take it. No such luck. Targeting system malfunction. And again. Damn it. That guy's really, really annoying me right now. Like really, really annoying me. Come on, Mueller. Let's do this. You operate this. And we need to kill him. I could run and gun, but I don't think I'd be able to positively kill him, but we're going to try it. And 77% or 79% chance. There we go. That took care of him. Not a problem anymore. You are on such low health, it's very, very sad. Uh, we'll move you over there. Two, two hit points, that's it. This makes me cry on the inside a little bit. All right, well, we can't move through this cloud of uh, poison, so we're going to have to stop right there. And we'll keep them on overwatch because enemies are going to be inbound. Johnson, you're going to have to move up here and take care of that next turn. Rice, we're going to move you up. Systems engaged. Looks like we got dead exults over here. So how Commander, close... So how close are we to leaving this area? Looks like he missed. That is not good. No, it's not good indeed. All right. All right. How close are we to leaving this area? It's got to be right around here. It's got to be. I think this has to be the truck right here. So... We can definitely hit them, so we are going to. Actually, we have a flank on him. Or we're being flanked, rather, by him. This one we're going to shoot at, because we know we can. Goodbye. Alright, you have another shot, so maybe you can uh, kill two birds with one stone. Um, we're going to take damage if we run through this, but we have to get to the end, which is right over here. I'll move like the wind. That looks like our target. Get over there and extract the weapon before that whole place goes down. Objective okay. Up. Extract the weapons before the whole place goes down. I think we can do that. Took a lot of damage this uh, episode, but... Come on, operate, please. There we go. We shouldn't need seven turns to reach that, but, you know, just in case. We're going to actually keep him up here for overwatching protection. And you. I'm going to have you go over here. Go on overwatch. Because I'm sure the enemy is going to be coming at us full force next turn if we don't manage to capture it. So we need to reload. Hostiles are moving on your current position. How did I know? It's like I'm Nostradamus or something. Luckily, they're only sectoids. Okay, I spoke too soon. <laughs> oh my god.
Yay, five damage. I'll take that any day of the week. You know what? Those two are close enough together. I think a grenade launcher might work. Maybe? Well, you. 83% chance. If we move, he's dead, so he has to just shoot from where he's standing. Good solid hit. My weapon is dry. However, you have a grenade launcher now. Make, make with the funsies. Yes. Yeah, there we go. Not bad. Did some damage. Okay, we can't have him move yet. Otherwise, he's going to take damage. So we're going to shoot all of the rest of our um, ammunition out. If we can. Grenade, perhaps? No. Okay, actually what we can do is she has lightning reflex. So we can trigger the reaction shots to miss by getting into cover. There we go. So that means that if we kill the other guy, we can actually move in and complete. Uh oh, looks like that one's triggering too. But that one missed as well. Okay. 87% chance, do some damage. So both of those reaction shots missed. And both of those reaction shots triggered, which means that we can actually move and successfully get the weapons. Hey, I hope that's the end of the mission. I wonder what's in here. Hmm, I wonder who this is. Kill them? But ow! Please, you have to help me find the others. Great Interesting. Work, Commander. It looks like the weapon everyone was after may be even more valuable than we thought. Okay, so we didn't kill all the aliens. We would have killed three more or two more, I believe. So it gave us poor on that. But that's because we kind of rushed through it. Rushed through it. We didn't want the dam to collapse on us. Did take a lot of damage in return, but we had to do what we had to do. Anyhow, I call that a success. Nobody died. They got close, though. Hey, Mueller is now, uh... Um, he's now a major. So, makes partial cover count as full cover. I'm all for that. Unfortunately, our... Some of our mechs are damaged. He's got some meld out of that too. Remember, we will be watching. This captive we recovered from the aliens, Annette, was apparently passed off to them by the Exalt organization. So far, she's been less than forthcoming about how she wound up in their control, or what makes her so valuable that they'd pursue her to this extent. Whatever the case, we need to keep a close eye on her. Okay, well, there's that. Scan for some activity. Gene modification is complete. This modification to the temporal lobe will cause massive brainwave spikes, damaging any psionic attackers. Which is good. We need somebody to damage psionic attackers, so that will take care of that. Satellite's going to be done. Our satellite is prepped and standing by for launch. We are ready to deploy it on your. All right, we have one satellite, so we're going to go to the Situation Room. We're going to launch a satellite. Looks like Brazil is the place that needs it the most, so let's launch it. And it reduced panic in that area, so all good. And how much money do we have? We have some money. 
like I said before, we need to build and buy some items. What we really need, some more rail guns. We're gonna manufacture two more rail guns. And what else could we possibly use? Carapace armor is good, Phoenix cannon's good. Hmm, I don't think I'm going for another satellite quite yet. As they're quite expensive. Scan for some more activity. Ooh, UFO has landed. Hmm. I almost want to ignore this. Because I don't think there's any reason to go after it, but... And a whole bunch of our people are getting healed right now, so... Normally I don't ignore them. Let's scan for some more activity. By ignoring these UFO contacts, we're putting our entire satellite network at risk. Okay, so, aliens terrorizing Moscow. The panic's pretty high here, and it's very difficult. We should definitely do this one. It's been a couple days, so hopefully our mechs have been healed. So, send Sky Rangers. Nope, only two of our mechs are going to be on mission this time, but we do have uh, Mama Bear back with us, so that's all good. We have Squatty Johnson, Captain Coffin... Let's see if we can't bring somebody else with us. We don't need two snipers, I don't think, so. Hey! You! Edit unit. Apparently you have, uh... Oh, that's that person that we captured. So, allows reaction shot to trigger on enemy attacks, not just movement, or uh, allows the person to move three additional tiles. We've done this one several times, so I'd like to go down the other route. So... And we need a new person to heal, so I'm gonna get, um, she's gonna be our field medic. So, load out. I'm gonna give her the good old carapace armor. Exalt laser snarp, laser assault rifle. Same thing as our normal, uh, laser assault rifle, it's just, um, just done by, a, or done by exalt instead. And med kit. There we go. I think this can be a successful setup, except for edit unit, loadout, minigun, yeah, give you the railgun back, you deserve the railgun, you're a cool guy. Alright, well, uh, I think we can launch mission. We have visual on the mission site. Begin the assault. Operation Hot Fist. That's slightly unsettling. <laughs> oh, the names they come up with. Uh, Alright, let's launch this guy. Alright, well, uh, this is going to be a very hard mission, so I think we'll do it next time. So thank you folks for watching this episode, and I will catch you guys next time.